coming to you from Studio 701, a digital media production at Rancho Bernardo High School. The show made for students, by students. This is Bronco TV. Here are your hosts, McKenna Huber and Jack Green. Hello everyone and welcome to another exciting episode of Bronco TV. This episode we have an update from ASD as well as a spotlight on boys water polo. We also have a segment on students and technology, so take it away Currents! Communication is the connection between us all. In a world where communication and information are flowing freer than ever, the world is becoming a smaller and smaller place. Uh, I text people to know like where they are and what they're doing and if they want to like go hang out. 77% of American households have internet connection, a 30% increase from just 10 years ago. With the introduction of smartphones, communication has been more mobile than ever. I text a lot. Students at RBHS use the internet and technology in a variety of ways. Most are limited to entertainment or homework related tasks. You go home and you know, most people are either doing homework or on Facebook. I mean, probably do it, try to do both at the same time, you know? Facebook and social media have allowed people to communicate and interact at a much greater speed. Though we don't know what the future brings, we can be certain that technology will play a role. McKenna. McKenna. McKenna, we're on TV. Oh. Sorry, um, and now an update with sports. RB Athletics are looking strong as ever as our very own Broncos gallop to get out of their minds at RB's first home football game. The loyal fans of Rancho Bernardo gather together at our own stadium to root for the mighty Broncos as they trample the Fallbrook Warriors 30 to three. The football team isn't the only one out there giving their best effort. The Aquaman of RB have started the season with a splash as they have learned to come together. This year is going to be different from last year because we're working a lot more as a team instead of a team full of individuals and hopefully that will help us uh, carry farther in CIFs. Boys Water Polo has done a lot more than master the art of teamwork to prepare for this season by dedicating themselves to the sport. Our team's getting ready for this upcoming season by doing doubles every day that we don't have a game and uh, we're working really hard on the weekends also. The team has high hopes this year as they are returning a lot of key players. Matt Sickle is a returning three-year varsity player. Also, we have Ryan Zakili, Mark Jones, and Thomas Ramsey. Some of the goals we hope to accomplish is to take the league title this year and also advance to the finals in CIFs, and I think that we have a good shot at doing both of those things. The squad is setting their goals high, and we all hope for their success. Nice job out there, Aquaman. And don't forget to show your support for boys water polo. Don't you think their Speedos give them enough support? <laughs> no, but seriously, now an update from ASB. Thanks, guys. So my name is Angeline D, and I'm your Vice President of Communications, and this, this is your ASB report. So for the moment that you've all been waiting for, Club Rush is this Thursday and Friday. Over 80 clubs and organizations have come out to show you why they think you should join their club. Whether you're a sports jock, a math geek, or someone that just loves Harry Potter, you'll be bound to find a club that you will definitely love. And by the way, speaking of amazing organizations, our ASB has created a new program called Bronco Bucks, awarding great students for good things that they do on campus. You can even redeem those at the student store for some really great goodies. The student store has some great things, whether you're a sweet tooth or a salt tooth, something along those lines. But make sure to check it out. There's some amazing things there. By the way, ladies, make sure to attend the Powder Puff meeting tomorrow at lunch so that we can show the guys that they're not the only ones who can strut their stuff on the football field. That's all for me. Back to you guys. Thank you as always for tuning in and watching Bronco TV. Don't forget to check us out on Facebook. Take it easy. Bye. <laughs> Bye. Don't you think their speedos give them enough support? <laughs> no, oh, I hit the mic, dude. You spit on me too. <laughs> All right, start from the top. I'm sorry. How'd you like it? Oh, I'm waiting for it. I'm waiting for you to just. Do the dance party, dude. There's a dance party going on. Oh, I can't take this. Where'd Crash go? <laughs>
mesh. Mesh, dude. Yeah. Dude. 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 Oh. dude. Where's my shade? It's so hot out here, I can't breathe. Oh.